Well, her name is Lucy Harris. And if Shaquille O'Neal has anything to say about it, you'll soon know her and marvel at her accomplishments. She is the subject of a short film hoping to get Oscar attention, and he is the executive producer. It's called The Queen of Basketball, and entertainment guru George Pinocchio has the story. Maybe the world would have known my name had I continued playing. But I didn't, <laughs> so I don't speculate. <laughs> Lucia Lucy Harris grew up in a small Mississippi town. She became a high school basketball superstar. It just came natural. And I wanted to honor Miss, Miss Harris, you know, by, by, by helping her story get out to the world. Former Laker great Shaquille O'Neal came on board when he heard Lucy's story. I had no idea who she was, and I like to consider myself a basketball aficionado. Why did she inspire you? Because of all the things that she had to endure. She made it possible for, for women to be able to do what they have done today. All the greats before me have made it possible for us to, to do everything that we want to do. In the mid-70s, Harris would go on to become a star player at Delta State University, winning championships, breaking records, making history. She was on the first ever U.S. Olympic women's basketball team, winning a silver medal in 76 and taking home another honor. She made the competition's very first basket. That's a record that never be broken. In 1977, she was the first woman ever officially drafted by the NBA, but she turned down the offer. She was now married, pregnant, and on to a new chapter of her life. And one day that will happen. Uh, hopefully I'm around to, 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 to see it happen, but I know she definitely could have played back then. When I got the ball, I knew my job was to score. And more than likely, I would score. And score, and score. Lucy with a rebound. She was a champion whose staggering statistics are now being recognized all these years later. So my goal is to make Lucy a household name. This woman should be celebrated. It's never too late to put up a statue. Her name in arena, like I said, is way overdue for this young lady. I hope she gets her recognition. The Queen of Basketball is available to see for free at NewYorkTimes.com. From home, George Pinocchio, ABC7 Eyewitness News. What a great story. Her name is Lucy Harris. We'll have to check that out.